media has been a buzz lately about the asteroid. Have you seen the post about it coming right at us? Remember, it's widely believed the dinosaurs were wiped out by an asteroid. So what do you say, John Shumway? Are they coming for us this time around? <laughs> you know, you got to wonder. Bruce Willis and, and Ben Affleck are probably ready to head to launch pad 39B <laughs> to go save us all. Even the dinosaurs at Jurassic Park, though, would be safe from this one. There is an asteroid. It's known as 2018 VP1, and it's coming right at Earth. So Carissa Sidor at the Buell Planetarium over at the Carnegie Science Center. Is it going to hit us? The answer is kind of yes. Uh, there is an asteroid that is projected to cross the orbit of the Earth, uh, but it is not probably going to hit us. All right, so how big of an asteroid are we talking about? Is this the movie Armageddon come to life? <laughs> uh, so not quite. So this asteroid in particular is about two meters wide. So it's about the size of a refrigerator. Um, and that is actually a pretty small object. So why is everybody getting so up in arms about this thing? Well, I think a lot of it has to do with, um, you know, current events. <laughs> uh, because in particular, this asteroid is projected to have its closest approach on November 2nd, which is a big night. Uh, <laughs> for a lot of reasons. All right, Carissa, if it does hit uh, our atmosphere, what something that size, what's gonna happen to it? So believe it or not, objects of that size tend to mostly break up in our atmosphere. Our atmosphere does a really great job of protecting us. Um, it's very thick, it's very dense. So objects hitting our atmosphere, uh, at, especially at high speeds, encounter a lot of friction in the atmosphere and that friction causes their surfaces to literally boil, to vaporize. Even an object of this size will burn up in our atmosphere high up. So the only thing that we might see is, is a really bright light show for, for a quick moment and then it'll be gone. Yeah, and the date of arrival is election eve. And I was reassured we do not need to be wearing helmets that night. But Heather, remember, this is 2020. It's the year of unpredictability. Anything could happen. Who knows what might happen. <laughs> no, I mean, that's, that's, the scary, that's the scary part of all this. It is. We just don't know what's coming next.